Hi there, Serial Trader here. Just gonna do a quick check in with crude oil. So we made a uh, one of the upside objectives, 69.55. So one of the Fibonacci relationships I was looking for to be met was that 50% retracement of that uh, wave three of C decline on that weekly chart. And that came in at 69.21. So we exceeded that, hit 69.55. But uh, now at this point, hang on, let me just hide the, uh, lines here so it's not as cluttered at this point it looks like we just have a corrective three wave decline off the top uh, short term here on the hourly chart you know an ABC down you can make the case and that we're possibly starting to come out of that channel and we're gonna be making another little jump up here so what else can I uh, point out here okay so from this low uh, of this previous short short term uh, pullback uh, that came in at 65.56. So from that low to our current high of 69.55, the 50% retracement uh, came in at 67.56, and we went as low on this little pullback to 67.49. So right around that 50% retracement found support, and now early signs that it's reversing upwards. So that's if you really want to have a tight stop on a short-term basis. 67.49 would be the place to put it. If you want a looser stop, I think it'd be quite bearish at this point to take out uh, 65.56. That that might imply that we have a uh, you know more significant top in place. So I'll just get rid of that. And just for a quick upside target, if in fact we do have a low here at 67.49, I've done a reverse Fibonacci of this uh, short-term pullback and. Our first objective, the 1.382 multiple, comes in at 70.34, and the 2.0 multiple comes at 71.61. Uh, so I'm still uh, kind of leaning on that we're going to hit uh, over 70 here, uh, but we'll see next week. So I'll just go to the candlestick chart quickly, and let's have a look daily. So we're still well above the T line. The T-line comes into play right now at around, oh, we'll say around low 67s. And we're actually still slightly above the 3T-line, the 3 period EMA. So certainly nothing bearish uh, looking at this graphic. Uh, we had a doji day on Friday, so put in a doji star. Uh, but that doesn't mean much unless it's confirmed with uh, some more price action in, in subsequent days. Uh, and also before the doji star we kind of had this um, large upper shadow and then a down day before that so you know I'm not going to give uh, too much emphasis unless we actually get uh, closing below the t-line still going to give the short term upside the benefit of the doubt but uh, we should be aware that in my opinion we're approaching some sort of top and it may already be in place but I'm, I'm not uh, currently thinking that's the case so hopefully that's helpful for you, and hopefully uh, this little upside trade in crude has benefited. I know I've uh, benefited from it myself. Uh, with the USO calls, they did quite well. Uh, so, Serial Trader signing off.